Fellow Americans, the U.S. general election is now less than two weeks away. I don't know about you, but when I look around, I see a good amount of political activity in terms of political energy being spent. But I see almost nothing in terms of high quality political discussion. Discussion where people on both sides agree to focus on a particular topic and then in a back and forth, try to produce something, something productive that made the conversation worth having. It sounds like a basic thing, and I think it is a basic thing, but I see almost none of it. It occurred to me that people might not know where to have these conversations. It also occurred to me that I have a quite large community of people here from all over the political spectrum. People brought together by a shared appreciation for thinking about politics, and presumably also for talking about politics. So I'm here today to provide a space to make that happen, and I encourage you to use it. Right now, in the comments section below me, you have hundreds, if not thousands of people eager to talk about these things, eager to have an intellectual conversation, to argue, to debate, to agree, or to disagree. You also have American voters from all over that, if you must, you can try to swing one way or the other. If you want some ideas, you can talk about who you're supporting and why, or who you're not supporting and why. Is there a major issue you think we should focus on? Is there a major issue being neglected? How do you feel about the election overall? About the culture we're in? This moment in time we're in? What direction do you think we're going in? And if a certain candidate gets elected, how would that change it? The point of this video, for once, isn't with me talking here. It's with you discussing below. So please, if you don't normally do it, try to make an effort and just this one time, say something. Start your own comment or look around for someone who's already made one and try to strike up a conversation. If the top comments are underwhelming, you can filter by new and then look around for something interesting. If you do say something, I would ask, please try to be respectful. Try to understand what people are saying and try to have that reflected in how you respond back. Try to actively build the conversation into something. If the conversation gets disjointed because other people are joining in, try to put it back together. I think you might be surprised how many other people want to have a meaningful conversation with strangers, a conversation that actually builds into something. I don't normally say this, but literally don't talk below if you're not going to contribute like that. This isn't a space to comment on the video or to say your first or anything like that. This is a space for intentionally good political conversation, even if it's just something basic like your thoughts on a candidate. If you don't want to talk, you could participate by just voting. But again, I'd ask you to be productive. If you see low quality sloganeering happening, basically just mindless political chanting, give it a down vote. If you see high quality conversation happening, give it an up vote so more people can see it. One last thing. This is after all an international space. If you're not an American and you want to participate, by all means, do it. But if you do, I would ask, just let people know you're not an American. That for one, lets them know that they're getting a perspective from outside their country. And two, lets them know to not waste their time converting you to their side if you're after all, not able to vote. So thank you for listening and thank you for being here. And please, by all means, with civility, have at it. Feel free to use this as a space throughout the rest of the election.